Pennsylvania when I was uh, very young. Uh, we moved from Brooklyn where there were a lot of Italians. My grandfather actually had a um, fruit and vegetable store. So when we went to uh, Brooklyn to visit, we would come home with lots and lots of uh, Italian vegetables and my mother would uh, make them for us. Sometimes she would make eggplant parmesan and I would bring uh, eggplant parmesan sandwiches to school and nobody ever heard heard of it. They didn't know what it was and now everybody eats that and it's served everywhere. My dad was from uh, Italy and he came here at a very young age with his uh, whole family. They came through Ellis Island. My father was not able to finish uh, school because he really had to earn a living to help support the family and to help pay for his brothers to go to uh, a school. He um, learned how to become a pattern maker and when when he tried to uh, get a job he was told that he would never get a job with an Italian last name in that field so he was forced to uh, change his name. And after that he became a citizen which was really a highlight in his life and our whole family was very excited when he became uh, got his citizenship papers. Education was very important in our family. There was no, no ifs, ands, and buts about it. When I got to college, I met people of different races and religions, and um, it really does open your eyes. It does help you understand other people. That You see that they're different on the outside, but on the inside, we're really the same. is open to women. You were either a nurse or a secretary or a teacher and I chose chose teaching uh, and I'm never sorry I did. I taught for a long time and I really enjoyed it. We were at lunch, somebody came up to you and they said how you changed their lives. Um, I remember that. Just, that's, it's just really good, really good to hear. Mm -hmm. Good. All well, the cars that were on the street. I said to my friend, I, I wonder who important died. I thought somebody had died and it was an overflow parking from the funeral home. I saw a great big 75 on the, on the um, lawn and everybody was there that I knew from people I play bridge with, play mahjong with, my, my book club, my old teachers, old friends, neighbors, everybody that I could have imagined had been there. It, it was really a thrill. <laughs> I could never be a movie star. I can't stand this. 